Today, everybody, we are going to be trying the Spirit Fruit for the very first time. That's right. Yesterday, when I was grinding to get Yama, I ended up finding a Spirit Fruit, which is insane. It is an absolutely amazing mythical fruit. And you know what? I definitely want to give it a try. By the end of the video, if this thing is overpowered and I love it, I might even consider buying it permanently, but we'll see. So let's go ahead and eat this bad boy. Oh, God. Oh my goodness, look at this. So I have two spirits already next to me. What the heck is going on? This is kind of crazy. So on the right side, you can see I have a spirit counter, which is basically always moving. Oh, interesting. So if I click on our buddy here, he summons a support buddy. Whoa, I can summon like little spirits. And if I click on this guy, what the heck? I can summon like little D. Okay, this is this is crazy. I summoned a frog. What the heck? We definitely have to get the max mastery and test everything out. So let's go ahead and get a quest. Reborn some skeletons. Let's see here. Frost fire grasps. Okay, did a little bit of damage. But what if I summon? Oh my goodness. What the heck? All right, summon another. Oh God. Ow. Oh my goodness. I have like minions. Dude, this is crazy. If my spirit's text is red, that's when I can basically summon myself a spirit. And that's pretty much what I should be doing until I get to some other abilities. Dude, this is crazy. And there we go. Oh my goodness. The levels are rolling in. They're rolling in. Uh, good thing I have 2x mastery. My goodness. Boom. Oh my goodness. I got a new skill. Let's see. Sky ruler. What does that do? Oh. I can just like fly. I mean, that's kind of nice. Okay. I mean, that's pretty simple. We got a nice movement ability, which are always appreciated. Hello. Bye. All right. Let's try this again. Hello, my friends. Boom. I can stun them there. Summon a bunch of my buddies. Ha 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 ha. It's actually pretty easy to grind with these guys. You literally just farm some spirits up and then you get like a large group of uh, people and then boom, look at that. You just do um, a ton of damage. You like buy a random surprise for 50 bones? Sure. Trade completed. I got fragments. Cool. So I guess this is supposed to be like big bombs fruit from uh, One Piece, which makes a lot of sense. Uh, let's go ahead and get another quest here because I did get myself. I did finish that one. And there we go. Look at my minions. Just They just attack everything. It's so funny. Look at that. It's great. I love the tree. But the frog is my favorite. The frog is definitely my favorite. Attack, minions! Attack! All right, I've just locked a new ability, Wrath of Raw. So let's try... Oh, my goodness. Okay, that was pretty dope. Look at that, dude. So you can stun them with frost fire and then do a ton of damage with Wrath of Raw. Dude, this is crazy. And then on top of that, you have spirits. Look at all the abilities I can do. Bam. Look, I have flying pigs. Ow. So it's going to take a little while for me to get to the next mastery. So I'll see you guys once we get the next one. Wrath of Shoe. Uh, I, I I like, sh I have nice shoes. Do you like my shoes? Yes. Yes. No. Okay. All right. So after a little bit of grinding, we finally have unlocked Wrath of shoe which means only one ability left and that is called end of times which sounds pretty awesome so here's like the current combo basically i just gather everybody around you know standard blocks fruit grind uh this is actually a really great place to grind by the way um but essentially i just go ahead and i use my frost fire grasp to stun everybody launch them away and then boom wrath of shoe does a ton of damage then wrath of raw does another ton of damage and then I can summon spirits pretty much anywhere. Um, and what I do is I just sort of fly around and summon a bunch of spirits to finish the job. And uh, usually I wait for the red bar. As you can see, that I wait for the red spirits. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much like a little, a little, little combo, I guess. It's not really a combo. It's just me doing damage. But you know what I mean. And uh, it's been pretty good. It's like super chill. Definitely nowhere near as good as Buddha for grinding. But we all know Buddha is like the best fruit in the game for grinding. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and keep on grinding away until we get the final ability, which sounds pretty dang epic. The end of times. I mean, that's it's got to do like a million bajillion damage. But uh, like I said, I, I, I'm enjoying I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying this ability. It's pretty cool. Look at that. I just go ahead, summon my spirits. Boom, boom. And I'm just like flying, chilling. Yeah, to finish the job for me, guys. Thank you. Thank you very much. And also, we've hit level 2018. So we're still being productive and having a good time testing out some new fruits. So this is great. Okay, guys. It has now been about an hour later. 
and look at this we have hit 350 we have just unlocked the end of times which is super cool all right we got to put this thing in the test let's go ahead and gather a bunch of demonic souls really quick this is you know hopefully you guys don't mind being my test dummies so here we go end of times oh my oh my god what the hell? <laughs> holy cow that was freaking crazy so now like having all four abilities on top of the spirits it is a pretty high amount of dps i mean just check this out let's go ahead and accept another quest really quick so it's just like you know we gather up our our friends here hey guys how you doing hey hello hello and then you go you start off the combo with a little wrath you do shoe you do a frost fire and then end of times and boom oh my god and not to mention i didn't even use my spirits i didn't even get to use my spirits there i didn't even need them this is kind of insane i think the only drawback is the fact that the movement ability is quite slow um that is probably my only thing. I mean, this is like not much faster than me just literally walking, <laughs> but I think that is quite literally the only drawback. So what do we think about the spirit fruit? Is it worth being, I think this is the fourth most expensive fruit at 2,550 Robux. That is extremely expensive. Is it worth the price tag? I, I actually don't really know. We might need to go try this in PvP. I, I really don't like PvP, but let's hop into a server and see how it does. I, I, I'm gonna regret this. I know I will. All right, I see an awakened Buddha. Oh God, it's like I'm fighting myself right now. <laughs> I actually don't know. I mean, this, like I said, I, I'm really bad at PVP, but we might as well give it a shot. We'll see how we do. Hopefully it doesn't run away by, by the time I get there. Excuse me, sir. I would like to, I would like to duel you. I would like to face you in battle. All right, I'll let him cook. Hey man, I'll let you. I'll let you finish your 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 fight. Clearly, you're fighting something. So I'll just I'll let him cook. I'm a nice guy. You can do this. You got this. Ow! 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 He ow ow. Okay, man's has already done some damage. Yo yo, chill chill. Yo chill. All right, all right. Man's is want he wants to play rough. You wanna play rough? All right, bring it bring it yeah yeah i've got my 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 abilities my spirits bring it on buddy whoa bam and bam end of times bam and then while i'm doing that summon my spirits whenever stuff's on cooldown yeah take this take this yeah Oh, okay, oh, oh, he's done some damage to me. Ah, and I'm dead. And I'm dead. Well, uh, that that went as well as I thought it would. Um, probably shouldn't have, you know, fought anybody. I think my problem is also all my stats. I should have not put anything in, in sword and should have maxed out my defense. But yeah, I think, I think the problem with the spirits is that like a smart player can just like avoid them completely. Um, but the abilities are pretty cool. So let me know what you guys think of this fruit. Should I get the permanent version of this one i don't know i i want to see what you guys think but i think next episode while we're training we might have to try out the dough fruit because that one is one i definitely want to use so let me know if you want to see that guys i'll see you in the next one thank you so much for watching and goodbye